Hey folks, this is Ashik Mathur. So welcome to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how we can create a Kubernetes cluster by using micro headers. So I would say this is the most easiest way to create a Kubernetes cluster uh, instead of creating EKS, AKS, GKE, or QAdmin or any other tool. So a few simple steps. Uh, I'll, I'll I'll be instructing you today how to do this. So let's get started without wasting our time. So first we have to create a three virtual machines. Uh, here I'm creating three virtual machine for high availability Kubernetes cluster. So we will be have a three masters and uh, minimum quorum two. Okay, so let's go to instance. Okay, now you can see that all my virtual machines are up and running and you can see the status running, right? So now we have to install uh, micro KTS. So we have to install micro KTS in each machine. So first we can connect virtual machine one. Let's connect this machine one. Okay, I have connected my virtual machine one, virtual machine two, virtual machine three. So as of now, this is a dummy instance. We don't have any configuration or any installation packages. So we have to start from scratch. So micro gateways we can install by using multiple methods. We can install by using APT repository. Uh, we can use yum repo. So here what I'm going to do, I'll try to install snapd repository. So from snapd repository, I'll install micro gateways. So what we have to do first. So first we have to connect the first virtual machine. Then we will install snapd first. Let's copy and paste this command uh, sudo apt update and sudo apt install snapd so let's execute the same command in virtual machine 2 and virtual machine 3 hey now you can see that all my virtual machine installed snapd so now we have to install micro -kates. to install micro -kates, we can use this command snap install micro -kates minus minus classic minus minus channel equal to 30 1.30 slash step hit enter so now it is installing micro -kates in virtual machine 1. Let's replicate to virtual machine 2 and 3. Okay, cool. Now you can see that virtual machine 1 and micro -kates is installed. 2 and 3, uh, both are installed, right? Now we have to uh, add on the plugins. For example, if you want a Kubernetes dashboard, ingress, or uh, DNS, all you can add uh, add-ons. So I'll just paste this command, micro -kates enable DNS, dashboard, storage, ingress, enter. Let's replicate to the virtual machine 2 and 3. Awesome guys, you can see that ingress is enabled virtual machine 1, virtual machine 2, virtual machine 3. So now let's join this in a single node or individual node into a cluster. For that we have to execute this command. So this is you can execute any of the node, but I'm gonna take virtual machine 1. Okay, so you can see that micro gate is at a node and this is giving some instruction Suppose if you want to join as a worker now, then you can copy this command. You can paste in virtual machine two and three. So my requirement, I want to uh, create a high availability cluster with minimum three master. I'll copy the first command. Copy this, go to virtual machine two. This is my virtual machine two. Just paste enter. Then go to virtual machine three, uh, paste and enter. Awesome guys, awesome. You can see that virtual machine 2 successfully connected with the virtual machine 1. So if I go to virtual machine 3, uh, this is uh, in progressing. So let's wait for a couple of seconds and uh, here you can see a successful message. So once this is activated, yeah, it's activated. So now I'll go to my virtual machine 1. So we can execute micro k then kubectl, get nodes. Awesome guys, awesome. You can see uh, this is my virtual machine one and this is my virtual machine two. This is my virtual machine three. Okay, now this is uh, became as a cluster. Uh, now what we can do, we can deploy Nginx. Uh, you can deploy any of the application. Uh, then you can create a ingress. You can create a uh, uh, like node pod. You can create a cluster IP service, whatever you want. Awesome guys, awesome. So thank you so much for watching my video. So please do subscribe to get more videos. Bye.